I wish to say a big happy 6th priestly anniversary to a very special Reverend Father Emmanuel Chibuzo Ubima Ibubemonso. Father was ordained a Catholic priest on 6th August 2011 at the Basilica of the Most Holy Trinity Onicha by Archbishop Valerian Madka Ukeke. He is the parish priest of Blessed Irene Tans Umudioka and also the spiritual director of Holy Ghost Adoration Ministry, Anambra State, Nigeria. Father is kind-hearted, he's warm, he's friendly, he can best be described as a people person because he knows how best to relate with people. He has a great sense of humor, he's super confident and dynamic, and he's a powerful minister. His humility and reverence are two of his greatest qualities. Father is very passionate about the Holy Spirit and about his ministry. Reverend Father Emmanuel Kobima Ebubimonso is the spiritual director of Holy Adoration Ministry. He's a very high profile individual and loves the Holy Spirit a lot. Ever since he took up his divine calling towards humanity, his ministry has settled lots of broken homes, make you positive thinkers, husband obligated and wife obedient and submissive. Joys of different testimonies, especially the gift and miracle of fertility over barrenness is the epoch of it all. Father is proficient in his teachings, though he has been a priest for a short time, but you can already see that the future holds great opportunities for him. Father Emmanuel knows how best to praise God, just like David in the Bible. Father has a worldwide reputation, having gone to Germany, Scotland, Wales, London, Malaysia, South Africa, USA, Ghana, Dubai, Italy, Australia, and China just to minister to the people of God and reaching out for souls. This man, this is a man that is so vast. He's vast in everything. He's a philanthropist. He's an activist. I mean, he does. He cannot stay where people are being cheated. He moves for the needy and for the poor and for the downtrod. So I think uh, he's a very, very powerful man and he has changed numerous lives. So I can go for a young man that made my, changed my life, that made me what I am today in any way. During one of my visits to Nigeria in 2014, I was very fortunate to meet with uh, Father Ibemoso. I went to a Holy Ghost Adoration Ministry through a friend of mine and I was amazed at what I saw. Seeing a young man like Father, you know, winning so much souls. On a day like this, we thank God for our gift to community. We thank God for our gift to the Catholic priesthood. As we celebrate the 60th anniversary of the ministry today, we pray to God, Lord, to God to bless you. May you grow from strength to strength, from power to power. Father Emma is somebody that is very humble, very humble, very hardworking priest, and very prayerful. People's ups and down touches him. People's ugly situation touches him. And that's what prepared him to move into prayer ministry to see how he can call upon the grace of God and poor people to relieve them from their pains and also to draw them closer to God. Father is a great athlete. He is very passionate about sports, especially football. He was a legend back in his seminary days. He made such an impression that his peers still talk about his legendary football skills even till date. Ebumoso is known for his selfless services to humanity. Over the years, he has recorded a great number of achievements. Ebumoso founded the international women's organization known as the Daughters of the Holy Spirit, with various chapters all over the globe. He single-handedly founded the famous World Youth Gathering 
bringing together youths from different places and empowering them spiritually. He has succeeded in the abolishment of idol worship in various towns in Anambra State. Through his ministry, he has been able to create lots of jobs to alleviate poverty. Father is known for his selfless services to humanity, and as part of his evangelization, he embarks on prison and hospital apostolate. Fadobima is indeed a godsend to humanity. God is using him to perform tremendous miracles in the lives of adorers. Daddy, you are a wonderful person, a source of inspiration to us all, and a great motivator. Thank you for all that you have done for us. You are a blessing to us. Keep up the good work. On this special day, 6 August 2017, as you mark your 6th priestly ordination anniversary, we pray that the good Lord will continue to bless you. May you continue to be sustained by His grace, and may your life in God's service always be filled with joy and laughter. Thank you.